Yo, welcome back, Ball Center Gaming Channel. It's your boy Phil. We are here playing Diamond Dynasty. Uh, I did, I did, I finished the Satchel Page story on the league, uh, the hist historic league for MLB the Show. So we got, we got the card, easy ninety for us to add to our pitching depth. So far, eighties and above, which is good. Uh, let's see, bench is looking decent. Hey, this is shaping up to be a decent team. So. With that being said, I think we're going to play a game or two, and then we're going to call it. Single mode, mini season. Let's go... Let's go Mark Mulder. How many games? Damn, we have to play all these games. So three inning games. Let's play... We'll play two. Let's see how it goes. Okay, let's go. Hold to play next game. Let's get it. We'll play on veteran. So start out learning. Damn. Select starters. Uh I gotta go school ball. Let's go. Well it depends how this one goes. New Orleans Finheads. Damn. Well, let's see how this goes. Ready to go now. And now the right fielder, Harold Ramirez. The pitch. Oof. This to center oh. field. Oh, drop. Damn. Finley right there to make the grab. And there's one down. Luis Arise stands in. First pitch, and he just misses. Good eye. Very good eye. GBL is different for a lot of reasons. And one of those reasons is having only eight teams in the league. How does that impact these teams? Well, I think it changes oh. a lot of things for these hitters. No score just getting started, top of the first. Next offering is in for a strike. Most Damn. obvious difference is you get really used to seeing these other pitchers, and it's not like they're running through a pitching book with 30 different teams anymore. Oh, Twins, come on. A strikeout. The high heat, too much on that one. Come on. Two outs, base is empty. And now it's Juan Soto. Oh, I was ready for that. Is fouled off. So who does it help more, the pitchers or the hitters? I think it helps the hitters because they become more familiar with the pitcher's stop. The shortened schedule, it doesn't help though. And that oh, cuts very the late. Of bats they get. So the GBL, it's just a different beast, boo. The wind of the pitch. Swings and misses, struck him out. Damn. Bottom of the first. And now it's going to be Juan Soto. That's a strike. That's strike one. All right, Singy, is there anything you have to eat or see whenever you're in New Orleans? Absolutely. I've got to get some jambalaya. If I don't, it was a failed oh, trip. Okay. Left hand batter waits. Sets him down on strike. Let's go, school ball. Good there we go. The trigger on a fastball at the knees. And now, Joe Mauer. And the first the pitch misses for ball one. Here's a 1-1. One, one. Got it. Up to the left, into foul ground. Racing makes the catch. And there's two away. Now it's the power speed combo. Munitaka Murakami. First offering and it just misses. Two outs. Ground ball to the Got right him. side. Takes it himself. That's the third out. Inning over. Let's go. Good ending. Back here at the ballpark, Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. Schwarber. Cortez, back to work. Strike oh, one. my lord. <sighs> I'm swinging way too early. 
I gotta get the timing down. Hacks and misses. It's a strikeout. Well, that pitch wasn't even close to being a strike, and that just goes to show you how defensive hitters can become when they're up against an 0-2 count. You're just hoping for a mistake somewhere. Oh near the my God! To, but right. This heading is on. Hold on, let me check. It is on veteran. Damn. There, he was clearly anxious. He was swinging when the ball left the hand. Oh my lord. No score here in the second. Next offering down in the dirt. Check swing, no appeal. I think he's trying to deep the pitcher. There's no way he's thinking he can hit that pitch. Olsen swings and drives it deep to right. And it hits the fence. Thank you. We finally got a hit. He takes the turn and holds it for his base. It's a one out single. There we go. Nick Ahmed here to hit. First pitch, not close. That one down the line and oh. foul ball. Olsen, the base runner at first with one out. Double play ball to second. Damn. There's one. And that's two. Pain. Welcome back. Now it's Jordan Alvarez. The wide to kick the pitch. And downstairs. That's in for a strike. Okay. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Now Got it. Hop up on the infield. Candelario makes the play one away. So digging in, Steve Finley. Swings through that one. Oh and one. Just off the inside edge. We're just getting tired, okay? Strike two. Gonna really need to hang in there with that front side against this left-handed breaking ball. Got him swinging. He swung over top of the curveball. Just a hammer, 12-6 curveball right there, boo. Let's see, let's see if we can finish, finish this uh, inning for me, please. Can throw a true 12-6 break, but he does. And you can't throw it any better than he did right there. Next offer is in for a strike. Oh, two. Finish this inning for me, please. On the ground of first, sneaks Damn. through base head. And that means Corey Seeger will have a chance to hit. Okay. Two outs, runner on first. And here's Corey Seeger to hit. First pitch Ball, doesn't out. find the zone. Ah, that's my fault. I don't know why I did that. Looks like this guy was looking at. Yeah, some him out. Manager out of the duck. Now on the bump, Drew Pomerantz. And he's got a big time breaking ball to contend with. Uh, hitters. Gonna have to pick it up early if they're gonna have any chance. Adam Dunn in the box with two gone. And takes a look at a called strike. The outfield shifted pretty heavily towards right field. The 0-2. Got him. And that'll do it. Oh, we need a miracle the now. Come across to score in the inning, courtesy of this two-run homer. Thank you for reminding me. To start the third, and there's a new arm on the mound, Billy Wagner. These are the spots where relievers really make a name for themselves, late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're Damn. put in these situations. Alex Verdugo, the batter now, as he swings and misses for strike one.
Oh my God! Good Lord! Now the catcher up to hit Ryan Servin. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Wagner, the lefty who lights up the radar gun. He features a four-seam fastball, a slider, a curve, and he works in a changeup. Comes up empty on Good the Lord. swing. 0-2 now. It might be time to choke up a little bit, get that front foot down early, maybe even just spread out. He's really late right now. Run! Oh, he's not making that shit. Yeah. Now only one out remaining. Well, it's kind of tough right here. Closer comes in and he strikes out the first two hitters. It's hard not to feel defeated and that this is going to go quickly. But you got to go up there, maybe try to find a way to choke up on the bat, spread out, put the ball in play, and maybe you can extend this inning. Now batting Jamer Candelario. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at one. Hey, seven straight strikes to start the frame. He's got a chance at an immaculate inning. That's the third. Yikes. Oh, look at the stop. Over to first. And what a play. Ball game. Two nothing, your final here in this one. For Chris we got our ass kicked. And our entire outstanding crew. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Oh, done win. Yep, we got our ass kicked. So, yeah, we're going to call it there. <laughs> I think these will be me grinding most likely. So I think we'll we'll figure out what I want to do with the series. So very rough first game. We gotta figure out what we're doing. So with that being said, hey, that was a test game to see where my skills are at. Obviously not good. So with that being said, uh, thank you for tuning in for Diamond Dynasty. Uh, we'll see you in the next episode. Hopefully there's a lot more improvement and we'll figure out what to do with the series. So with that being said, make sure you like and comment down below. Subscribe, put on notifications, and we'll see you in the next one. Deuces.